Today, Mike vlogs about vlogging. It's much more than a way for the conceited to talk about themselves. Vlogging's a great way to chronicle all the things you've accomplished. Think of it as a tech-savvy and not lame diary that you keep unlocked for the world to see. What is up, everyone? My name is Zesty Mike, and today we're gonna talk about vlogging, specifically for those of you who are wanting to start up vlogging and haven't quite got the knack of it yet. Whether you wanna be inspirational or flat out entertaining, or you just wanna share stuff that you wanna remember, vlogging can be a lot of fun if you do do it right. We all know what you need equipment wise, a camera, but some people don't seem to grasp how to actually vlog. The number one issue I see with vloggers is vlogging angles. I see people vlog all the time like this, or like this, or even this. However, when you're vlogging, you're actually talking to a person, and when you're talking to a person, you're not gonna talk to them like this, or like this, or even them. Instead, if you care about the person, you're gonna talk to them straight on, you're gonna make eye contact, and actually make them feel like you care. For instance, like this. Not only that, but it's a little bit more flattering to talk to the camera straight on. Do I look pretty? Believe it or not, there's actually a lot of psychology with YouTube. If your viewer feels like you care about them, chances are they're gonna care about you and what you have to say, but if they feel disassociated to you, they're not going to want to listen to what you have to say and chances are they're not going to watch your videos. So this is why eye contact is so important. So make sure you care about the people viewing your videos, make sure they know you care, and show them your face not your double chins. Do I look pretty? The second biggest issue with vlogging is feeling uncomfortable vlogging in public. This is hands down the biggest question I get asked is how do I feel comfortable vlogging in public? The fact of the matter is if you're in public, chances are you're never gonna see someone you know, so why should you care about what they think? If you're not gonna see them again, then it doesn't matter what they think. And if you do know them, they already know you're crazy and talk to a camera, so it doesn't matter what they think anyways. Lastly, you can use vlogging in public as promotion for your channel. If someone does stop you and ask what you're doing, you could simply tell them, tell them what you do, show them your channel link, and maybe even give them the business card if you have them, and you might have a new viewer. A good example of this is the other day, two girls passed me while they were vlogging, and they made eye contact with me, and as they saw me looking at them, they put the camera down here and hit it, and kept on talking and acted like they were just continuing their conversation. Once they passed me, they brought the camera back up and continued talking once they saw I was out of frame. And the funniest thing about this was, I was wearing my YouTube shirt, so they saw that I actually was a YouTuber, or at least watch YouTube, so I understood what they were doing, and they couldn't even vlog in front of me. So they lost a potential viewer and someone to network with. But anyways guys, that's it for today's video. I hope these tips are helpful if you are looking at starting up a vlogging channel. And if you do have any vlogging specific questions, feel free to ask, and I could try to answer it in the next video. Anyways guys, that's it. If you want to see more of my tips and tricks, you can click the playlist in the sidebar, or if you want to visit my personal channel, you can check me out in the link in the description below. But anyways guys, that's it, and we'll see you next week. See ya. Impulse is produced by the Freedom Network. Ever wanted to earn revenue from your videos? Freedom offers a great partnership program which includes access to hundreds of thousands of audio tracks, sponsorships with great partners, and most importantly, a no lock-in contract. You can leave at any time for any reason. We accept everyone, both big and small. For more information, click here or visit the link in the video description.